So Jura's newest machine, the Z10, can do cold coffee drinks. I'm really excited to learn more about this machine. Okay, so I'm here with Manny, who is the business development manager for Jura here in BC. Uh, he is the man who knows everything about the Z10. He's used it extensively, and he's going to tell us how this new machine actually makes cold coffee drinks. Yeah, it's the only machine, super automatic, whole machine, yeah. worldwide, I said worldwide, that makes cold drinks. Okay, so it makes like a coffee drink cold. It's correct. <laughs> this so is awesome. It is. So similar to the S8, it's a touch screen. So that's a Jura S8 line, the, yeah. the, like the baby one to this like one. Like the baby, yeah. Okay. It's the Lunar's design with the beautiful sort of finishes. It's just absolutely gorgeous. It comes yeah. in white and black. So all you do is a touch screen. In the top here, you press this little button, and it tells you the different things that you're required to do. So if you want any cold drinks, it tells you like the snowflake there. Yeah. And it turns the coffee into a small system where uh, the system comes in and drips it into cold cold brew. So it drips, so you're saying this slows the process yes. down, so it takes a while to make a drink? Exactly, and it's okay. cold brew. So let's just do an espresso here, so you okay. see. So we've got some ice in there top in already. There. So you need your ice okay. bucket. Yeah. And then you just press espresso. And you set it on cold already, and, and then you put. And you, and okay. you press espresso. Okay. So as you can see, it's gonna take a little bit of time. To yeah, because if I drew a regular coffee out of a Jura with yeah. that ice in it, it would melt it like that. Oh yes, it's correct. Right? It would it's just correct. be kind of lukewarm. Exactly. As you can see here, it, it's blue, so that means cold, right? So it's now starting to bring cold. It's cooling down, Yeah. and it's gonna bring it out right now. Okay, so the Z10 over the S8, is it the same as an S8, but it makes cold drinks? It's correct. Okay, so same capacity, same, same capacity, everything. Same everything. Right, okay, so you would buy the Z10 for the cool capacity. Well, uh, and also because it's a little larger machine, as you can see, it's, the design is so modern, and the finishes are unbelievable. Yeah. So look at this now, how it's brewing. Okay. Very slow. And I'm gonna ask you to taste this one. Yeah. Because you're gonna, and now, what's nice is to add a little bit of syrup, because it just gives it that touch. <laughs> and being in this afternoon, you see okay. how, how slow it is, you're gonna, you're gonna see. And the yeah, ice yeah, yeah. hasn't melted. Yeah, the cup is cold. So we can st cancel that so we can finish that. It's gonna say enjoy there. So now I'm gonna put a little bit of syrup just to make Jed happy. A little bit of syrup in there, a little splash of... There. Now try that. You gotta go to heaven on that. Whoa, it's beautiful. Very refreshing yeah. for no, it smells amazing. summer. How's that? It's a cold drink. The ice is melting. No, it's, no, no, it's, it's no. melting, it's a little bit, but not yeah, much, no, it's no, still it's in there. It's still there, it's, well, um, I didn't put that much, but it's still there. Yeah, yeah, no, and, and it it's tastes- very flavorful. Yeah, I don't usually take sugar in my coffee, no, so. No, I don't, so you can <laughs> do with this like But it tastes, it tastes good, being cold with yeah. a little bit of sugar, you're right, it's, you it's great. You can sort of do frappuccinos, etc. Same thing as all the other ones. Here you can, you know, you can do two drinks, you know, strength of the beans. Yeah, so let's go over the, the cold drinks you can do. You can do a, a straight up cold espresso. Yeah, you, well here they are. You can do espresso, you can do a cappuccino. Okay, so cold a cappuccino, yeah. cold flat white. Cold flat and what white. about when it pulls through the milk? It what happens pull, there? Well, when the milk pulls, it doesn't heat it. it so okay. It, it makes it nice so and chill. So it frosts it, it cold. Exactly. Okay, exactly. so and it does make it frothy. Yes. Okay, does, yeah. okay, can you show us one of those? Uh, yes. All right, so now you want to explain what you're doing here? Yeah, so I'm doing a cold cappuccino. As you can see, there's the little ice, icicle. So I'm going to press that. And here comes, a, here comes the cappuccino. I'm going to make not so much. As you can see, because it's it's going very slow and and producing the the cold drink, it's not like when you're doing a, a cappuccino, 
It's just quite slow. Put your finger in. Yeah, it's cold. So one of the things about this machine is, for example, you just press on the product and you hold, and then it'll show you the product, product name, etc. So here you can go to product name and you can name it. Put your product, Mike, Susie, Julie, which is pretty cool. And also you can, uh, you know, do a cold drink, so now that's cold, as you can see the icicle. So now you save that, and every time you do your drink, it'll be cold. Uh, you can do the product settings, so you can do, you know, so much. Strength of the beans, volume, milk, milk foam, temperature, milk temperature, you know, so you can pre-program all the levels Look at all the different things, right? That is what this set 10 is, makes, which is amazing. Okay, Manny, this is, uh, this is tremendous. So the Z10, if you're considering the S8, the Z10 is gonna give you the opportunity to do cold drinks, Correct. which is a really neat feature. Yes. So, you know, this is, this is pretty extraordinary. This is something that you'll be seeing at Cook Culture very soon. Beautiful machine. And uh, we're excited, so thanks for the demo on that. Yeah, a pleasure. So in this video, we went over a few of the main benefits of how the Dura Z10 uses the cooling function, which is really quite unique because it pulls cold water through the beans. It doesn't heat it and then cool it. It actually does a cold extraction process, which is pretty fantastic. But there's also some really, really fantastic technology in this machine that we didn't touch on that I've listed below. So I've made all the comparisons below. So if you look at the below on this video, you will find those there. And it's pretty wild to see how this guy sets himself apart. All right, any questions, please throw them below. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.